Romans chapter 1, verses 21 through 23 says, For though they knew God, they did not glorify Him as God or show gratitude. Instead, their thinking became worthless and their senseless hearts were darkened. Claiming to be wise, they became fools and exchanged the glory of the immortal God for, the, for images resembling mortal man, birds, four-footed animals, and reptiles. Paul illustrates that although God has made himself plainly known to people through the creation of the world, many refuse to glorify him as God and give thanks to him. To do so would, of course, require that people bring their own desires under his control. Instead of glorifying him as God, many would make idols for themselves that would then allow them to worship and serve however they desired and give glory to those created things above the immortal creator. While these would profess to be wise in what they did, they were actually foolish. God continues to make himself plainly known to people throughout this world today through the evidence of his creation. Yet many who profess to be wise ignore this evidence for an immortal creator and do not give him the glory he deserves. Instead, they will choose to give glory to many other created things. While these idols can come in many different varieties, they all share in the fact that they are not truly worthy of the glory that only God deserves. Whether they are statues or people or what is called science or money or any other created thing, they all exchange God's glory for that which is created. Today's response to hearing God's word is this. Don't exchange the glory of God for anything. If you were exchanging money, for example, you would want to give a particular amount in one currency and receive the equal or greater equivalent of the other currency. So whenever you decide who you will worship and serve, you should carefully consider the glory of the options. While many created things offer the potential of living how you desire to live today, it is all limited glory. However, living to worship and serve the true creator in God results in glorifying the one who possesses an unmatched amount of glory.